Oscar, hi, hi Vane, hi Domingo, Jorge, and Ana. Good evening, teacher. How are you? Hold on, guys. All right, very good guys. Welcome to another class. All right, so this is our second class of this intermediate level two. So we're going to continue with the class that we had yesterday and we're going to check the activity, the final activity that we did before we left, all right? But before that, let's see, Oscar, how was your day today? Can you tell us a little bit about your day? I'm fine, thanks. Excellent. Anything special that day was busy or wasn't that busy? It's very busy. It's very busy. My job this day is very hard. Ah. Hola, me fui. <laughs> me desconecté. So, so, teacher. Oh, no. All right. I'm just going to close my windows here. Maybe that's why. But I was listening to you guys. Okay. Yes, yes. It's only for uh, two seconds, one second. All right. Hold on, guys. I'm just sending this email right now. Okay, very good. Oh, Bismarck, you're here. All right, perfect, guys. Okay, so let's see. What about um, Carla Vanessa? How was your day today? Hi, teacher. Uh, always busy. Always busy? All right. Vane, oh. where do you work? Carla Vanessa, where do you work? I work in a manufacturer called Textiles La Paz. Oh. Um, mm-hmm. And I'm in the uh, purchasing team. Okay, purchasing team, all right. Textiles La Paz is in Zona Franca El Pedregal. Yes, it is. Yeah, I used to go there every Saturday, Carlita. Oh, really? <laughs> I had a group of students before pandemic. That was like four years ago. I used to go every I Saturday. I hear about. Yeah. All right. Yeah, that was nice. Going there was nice every Saturday. But you know what? Uh, I also went to Haynes every day of the week at the same Zona Franca. Uh huh. But I was. I mean, day? Yeah, every day. It was from Monday through Friday, two hours from four to six. Yeah. Oh. Plus, I was only on Saturdays. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It was the whole Saturday. It was nice. I met many nice people. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> it's nice to know you. Yeah, very good. Excellent. Bismar, how are you, Bismar? Hi, teacher. Hello, I am fine. Excellent. We missed you yesterday. What happened? Hey, I am a problem with my WhatsApp and I I can recite the, the message. Oh, okay, very good. Bismar, can you do me a favor? Can you change your name to your full name? Sorry? Su, para renombrar su, su, um, su perfil. Hay que poner todo su nombre, Bismar. ¿Lo puede hacer usted? Ah, okay, okay. Ahorita lo voy a cambiar. I'm sorry, Gracias. pero es como fiesta patronal por aquí. So I'm sorry about these um, fireworks. 
<laughs> All right, sorry. Hi, Evan. Good evening, Trini. Hello, Vanesita. Very nice. Okay, guys, so yesterday we stopped on this. Just give me a second. Yesterday we were talking about this. Remember that? Yes, I don't sleep thinking in that position. <laughs> Very good. Okay. Uh, let's see. So yesterday, uh, ¿quién nos tomó la foto? Abner, ¿verdad? Abner took the picture yesterday. Let yes, yes picture is in the, the, the picture is in the WhatsApp group. Yeah. Right now. Sorry, guys. I'm sorry about that noise. All right. According to the picture that we had yesterday, number one was idea generation. Number two, it was idea screening. Number three was business analysis. Number four was product development. Five, concept development and testing. Six is test marketing. Seven is lounge. And number eight is commercialization, right? That's what we had yesterday, okay? now. According to the answers of the book, all right, everything is good except for two. All right, vuelvan a ver ahí. I'm going to give you a couple of minutes, all right? Take a look at these um, steps and decide if they were okay as how we had them yesterday or you would like to change something. Les doy un minuto. Think about it, all right? If you want to leave it like yesterday, it's okay. Ahí lo tenemos en el grupo de WhatsApp. The picture que mandó ayer Abner, I think it was. And then you can compare. Si usted quiere cambiar algo, change it right now. Okay? I'll ask you in one minute. All right, would you like to change anything, guys, from the answers that we had yesterday? Or it's okay. If everybody agrees that ideas generation is number one. Yes? All right, everybody agrees that number two is idea screening. All right? Yes? All right, very good. Um, everybody agrees that number three is concept develop, uh, development and testing. Ese teníamos ayer. En la número yes. Three. Yes, right? All right. What about four? What do we have in four from yesterday's class? Four is product development. The teacher in... And number three. 
is concept development and testing. Uh, okay. All right. Now, number four. ¿Qué es lo que teníamos ayer para la cuatro? Repítame, anybody? Product development. 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 Nadie le quiere cambiar a ese, a ese número cuatro. Le, ¿Lo dejamos así o we, we change something? Eh, I, I think that is business analysis. That's right. Number four. Yes. Yes, Vane, very nice. That would be number four. Es hay que cambiarla. So business analysis is number four. And product development is number five. All right. So change that in case you had it. What about number six? What do we have for number six? Yes, marketing. Yes, marketing. Yes, very nice. Y luego teníamos number seven. We have um, launch. 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 And then commercialization, right? Yes. Ah, all right. Anybody would change anything? Lo dejamos así. Mm. Or you guys would change anything here. You say the number two is wrong. <laughs> mm. According to, uh, I'm going to tell you this. Uh, teacher. Yes. Question. Yes, sir. So uh, that would be the number two because business that I know anymore. Business analysis, analysis. Number number one, idea generation. Yes. Number two, idea screen. Yes. Number three. Concept development. Concept development. Okay. Testing. Number four, business analysis. Yes. Number five, product development. That's right. Okay. Thank you. Yes. Then it says marketing. All right. Now, according to the answers of the book. All right, we have commercialization number seven and lounge number eight. Now, do you guys agree with that or you disagree with it? Uh, no, I, dis I disagree with you. With okay. you. Uh, seven. You Sorry, Domingo, continue, please. Oh. All right, Daniel, uh, why, why do you disagree? Because for the uh, when I when I uh, um, have a product, I first the launch and I and I can I can launch in a on a special event. I don't know. Okay. And, and then after uh, you commercialization to sell the product. Okay. All right, very good. Anybody else? Domingo, you were gonna say something. What do you what do you say? Domingo, do you disagree? Is 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 I as uh, I do the acuerdo con you agree? Daniel. Uh, do you agree con Daniel? Is 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 the I do la, launch the product he lays uh, the uh, uh, the commercialization. Okay. All right. Very good. Anybody else? Anybody else that agrees or disagrees with it? Háganme un favor. Creen que pueden mandar a los que ya tienen el eh, manual descargado, lo pueden mandar al grupo de WhatsApp. Can someone send it on the WhatsApp group, please? All right, let me know if you can. All right, very good. So, um, uh, Carlita, Benazir. All right, Carlita, what do you think? Lounge? First and then commercialization or commercialization and then launch. Uh, I think um, commercialization. Launch. Launch. Yes. 
All right, that's okay. What about Walter? What do you think? Which one is first, lounge or commercialization or vice versa? Lounge. Why? And the lounge first and then commercialization. Why? Uh, depends on the product because some products start with introduce a uh, uh, advertising commerci commercialization and after that launch the product but uh, I think in other products started with launch and in the same time uh, apply a commercialization. Mm, okay, all right. Okay, interesting. Very good. Anybody else? Anybody else about this topic? Which one is first? Chamba, what do you say? Well, uh, I think is first launch because you present the product mm -hmm. and then you, you commercialization and different, uh, how do you say, proveedores? Providers or suppliers? Uh, you can go to the, the suppliers. Okay. I think that. All right. But... So you first launch and then you commercialize, right? Yes. Okay. Yes. 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 Thank you. I think I, I think the first commercialization when the task commercialization is about uh, publicity. Uh, publicity, uh-huh. Publicity, this is commercialization. Right. And then before the launch, the... And then they, they launch the product after. Right, Oscar? Sí, primero la commercialization and después el lanzamiento. Claro. The first oh, commercialization. Oh, okay, if we see it from that perspective, I think you're right. Okay, very good, interesting, okay. We're going to leave it there. All right, I'm going to take the first attendance. Solo déjeme tener la asistencia en la mano. Miss? Yes. Maybe, maybe the, the launch and commercialization is both in the same time. Oh, both at the same time. Why, Chamba? Why do you say that? Because you launch the product online and you can buy it, uh, the clients to, to buy the product and you can say you can you can buy the product in different uh, grocery store or different market. Okay. All right. Maybe also that can happen. Very good, Chamba. Interesting. All right. Thank you. I'm going to take the first attendance. All right. Uh, tenemos aquí Abner Eli Fuentes Flores. Hello. Hi, Abner. Adela Trinidad González Consuegra. Trini? Present. All right, Claudia Guadalupe Arias de Gómez. All right, um, Daniel Antonio Luna. Present teacher. Domingo Alexander González. Present teacher. Ever de Jesús Candray Montano. Present. Jorge Alfredo Argueta Flores. Present. José Roberto Martínez Bernabé. Carla Benacir Lara González. Present. Carla Michelle Brizuela Portillo. Present teacher. Thank you. Carla Vanessa Vázquez de Ayala. Present. Kevin Esteban Mejibar Merino. All right. Um, Leticia Guadalupe García de Miranda. Mariano José Paca Santa María. Marianito's not in right now. Okay. Uh, Oscar Arnulfo Villatoro Herrera. Present. Rafael Ernesto Hernández Sandoval. Present teacher. Salvador Augusto Sorto Rivas. Present. Eh, Vanessa Noemí Reyes Lemus. 
Victoria María Vázquez Juárez. Walter Omar Castaneda Perlera. Mayra, Presente. Mayra Roxana Hernández Flores. Vicky Dinora Gutiérrez de Durán. Bismar Ulises Martínez Ortiz. Present teacher. Doris Guadalupe Alfaro Rodríguez. And Ana Maria Palacios Araujo. Present teacher. Thank you. All right, very good. Para Ana Maria and for Carla Michelle, welcome to the course. All right, so thank you for joining class tonight. Very good. Okay, guys, so let's um, continue here. Let, we're going to find out exactly what they mean, tomando el punto que decía Oscar, what they mean with commercialization, all right? So this is what I want you to do. All right. All right. Just give me a second, guys. I just want to see something. Okay. All right, this is what I want you to work on right now. I'm going to send you to your groups, all right? Tenemos estos conceptos o estos, estos pasos aquí. All right, product development, idea screening. Ahorita ya no nos interesa, no en esta actividad, the, the steps or the order, all right? Concept development and testing, launch, business analysis, commercialization, test marketing, and ideas generation. What are you going to do? You guys are going to go to your groups and you're going to define what this step, these steps mean, all right? What is for you product development? What is for you idea screening? What is for you concept development and testing? Y así hasta terminar las ocho, okay? I don't want you to Google it, all right? Los que ya vienen anterior, no los mando a que vean en la inter. Mando a que lo traten de hacer ustedes solitos como grupo. All right, la definición, que es para ustedes uh, launch? What is for you commercialization? All right, lleguen a un consenso y lo escriben. Siempre escriban todo lo que hacen para poder revisar cuando regresemos, ¿de acuerdo? All right, guys, so it's like 8.30, vámonos un rato y yo los voy sacando a, los, a todos después. All right, ¿hay alguien que no puede participar? Abner, can you participate? Yes. Thank you, what about Ana? Ana María, can you participate? Yes, teacher. Excellent. Thank you. All right. Very good. So let me see here. I'm going to group, I'm going to make groups of two. All right. Let's go.
Hi, Roberto. Hi, hi teacher. Hi. Roberto, los acabo de mandar a los grupos. Están ahorita en la página, ahorita le digo, en la página 10, ejercicio 4, pero ahora haciendo las definiciones de cada eh, paso de los que vimos ayer. Hola. Roberto. Sobre teacher, solo, solo que voy a estar como oyente, no, no, no puedo participar ahora en esta sesión. Ah, bueno, o oh, si usted se queda aquí, Roberto, no hay problema. Está bien. Ok, gracias. Acá me quedo. Ok, thank you. Gracias.
Ay, Carlita. ¿Qué le pasó, Carlita? Que hubo un corte de energía y ah. se, se me fue el internet, que ya comienza acá a llover. Ah, ¿verdad? Aquí ya veo oscuro. Yo, eh, Carlita, ¿en qué grupo estaba? Eh, yo estaba con Oscar Arnulfo, teacher, pero él ya se había salido anteriormente. Ah. No sé si él también este, está teniendo problemas, sí. Ah, sí, porque no está, es cierto, tiene razón. ¿Verdad? Sí, ¿y cómo iban? ¿Ya habían avanzado, Carlita? Eh, no, no, teachers. Eh, como no, ninguno de los dos tenemos computadora, entonces habíamos quedado que íbamos a hacer dos y dos cada uno y después nos las íbamos a compartir. Ah, vaya. Si gusta entonces, uh -huh. porque no sé si él va a lograr entrar. Si gusta la mano uh -huh. grupo y usted okay. tiene un compañero, ¿verdad? Ok, teacher. Excelente, thank you. Vaya, Carlita, ya. Ok, thank you. Thank you. To the business, the business. Ajá. Ahí, ahí sí ya lo está. Aquí puede ser que lo estamos generalizando, ¿verdad? Porque aquí es donde se decide el precio, se decide la fecha de lanzamiento, se decide, se, se decide el mercado objetivo, eh, el sector, eh, si en dado caso se va a sectorizar o no se va a sectorizar el tipo de, de, de producto o segmentación, que le llaman segmentación dentro del marketing. Entonces, yo digo que sí podemos poner que this the period, is the period of the time you see to plan the commercial the strategy to the, to the business. And that's it. Hi, Ever. Hi, Rafael. You finished? No, no teacher. On the middle, on the middle, business analysis. Excellent, you guys are doing okay. No se preocupen, vamos bien. All right. Okay. Okay, okay. okay. Bye. Sorry?
Hi, Oscar. Hello, teacher. I took with my connection. You lost your connection? Yes, yes, ah. yes. Okay, no se preocupe, Oscar. También, de hecho, Carlita también perdió la conexión y hace un ratito entró. Sí. Voy a mandar a otro grupo para que les ayude a los otros compañeros, ¿de acuerdo? Ok, no problema. Thank you. Vaya, Oscar. Gracias.
Hi, Leti. Hello, teacher. I need your internet. I'm sorry. All right, that's okay, Leti. That's fine. Ahorita voy a sacar los demás compañeros de los grupos, okay? Okay, okay, teacher. All right, guys, very good. Um, I hope everybody was able to finish. If not, we can continue it a little later. All right, uh, let's see. Vamos a ver, we have here, vamos a empezar con product development and idea screening. All right, let me see here. What about um, Chamba's group? All right, can you give me the two definitions for those two words that I just mentioned? For, for what, what, which one? For product development and idea screening. Idea screening is the process to explain the idea. Okay. And Product development is the creation for a new product from the, the idea until the commercialization. Oh, interesting. All right, very good. Thank you. Let's see. The group of Carla and Michelle. All right, can you tell me the same two? Uh, the tiger on, on, the, on the same. Excuse me, Carla? Lo siento que fíjense que casi no le entiendo. No sé si me inscribieron mal en el grupo porque yo venía de básico. Oh. No le entiendo muy bien cuando está hablando inglés, entonces. Ok. Carla, ¿en qué, en qué básico estaba anteriormente? Estuve en el, hice el primer módulo, pero no sé si por error me inscribieron aquí. Sí, ha de haber sido. <risa> sí, Carlita. Sí, porque... Estoy perdida, lo siento, I'm sorry. No se preocupe. A ver, Carla, déjeme tomar nota y de su nombre completo, obviamente, y yo voy a llamar mañana en la mañana a mis compañeros para ver cómo, cómo le ayudamos, Carlita. Oye, porque sí, estamos, nos hemos saltado varios. Sí, entonces pues estoy algo perdida, lo siento. No, tranquila, no se preocupe. Entonces terminó el básico 1, me dice. Sí, el básico 1. Entonces usted tendría que estar en el básico 2. Sí. Ok. Muy bien, vaya, Carita, no se preocupe. Igual, usted quédese con esto a las cuestiones de los minutos, ¿de acuerdo? Entonces, está bien. esté conectada y escuche, Carlita, oye. Va a estar bien, gracias. Thank you, Carlita, very nice. Ok. Let's see, vamos a ver entonces, what about Avner and Anna? Can you tell us about those two um, ideas? Yes, of course. Okay. Uh, can you hear me? Yes, loud and clear. I'm sorry, can you hear me? Yes, I can, Avner. Okay, Anna is going to do it super good. Continue, Anna. No, please. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> I believe in yourself. Okay, I'm going to do that. Um, development, uh, product development and idea screening, that's correct? Yes. Um, uh, for me, uh, product development is uh, uh, one of the steps that you have to do uh, when you want to sell something. And it's, some, it's one of the important uh, steps that you have to do because in this, in this moment, you are going to select uh, the product and you are going to say if this is going to be uh, for old people, um, if you want to select a child or um, if you want to select that sport things or something like that, you have to select this because then you have to add a, another thing to improve something that has been created or if you want to create another new things. And you have to, um, you have to make in a storming and then you are going to uh, do a, or make a screening. How can I say uh, a screening idea, idea screening? Okay. I think. Right. Okay, very nice. Thank you. Anna, do you want to say anything else besides what Avner just told us? Yeah. You can do he, it. <laughs> he gave the concept principle, so that's okay. <laughs> yeah, I think it is a proof about the concept. Uh, you know, uh, it's like we take it and we put it in something physical, you know. The principal idea, I think, is like that. All right. Okay. Very good. Thank you. Uh, let's see. What about, let's move on to the other two words. We have concept development and testing and launch. All right. So we have those two here. What about Daniel? Daniel's group. Daniel, you were working with Carlita and with Walter. Yes, teacher. Uh, Walter is right uh, definition. But I, I can I can say on on my in my own words the sure. definition of launch. Okay. Launch is where where you uh, present the products to the to the clients or uh, or future clients potential clients. Okay. All right. Mm -hmm. Very good. Now uh, Daniel is present present. present. Yes, very nice. Okay. Yeah. Okay, next one. Um, um, concept. Let's say the other definition, concept development and testing. We wrote, it's a prototype for measure the quality reference standards, what was created. Okay, all right. All right, very good, thank you. All right, what about Domingo and Jorge? Esas mismas dos. Concept development and testing and launch. Uh, concepts, development, and testing. Yes, what is uh, it uh, for that one? Uh, uh, the, uh, the famous trio. Uh, the famous three I wrote is was uh why are the same things muse accompany uh, the certification. All right, so trial and error is important. All right, very good. And what about lounge, Jorge? I can't hear you, Jorgito. Jorge, I cannot hear you. Oh, le decía teacher, perdón, sorry. Es que Domingo la tenía digitada porque pensamos que le iba a presentar. Entonces. Ah, lo puedo presentar. Yeah, go ahead, eh, Domingo, so I can see lounge. Ah, eh, the, 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 the product goes at the market. Ah, the date the product goes out to the market. Very good, Domingo and Jorge, very nice. Okay. That's fine. All right, let's see. Next one, we have the other two definitions, business analysis and commercialization. Um, Carla Vanessa's group, can you tell us about that one? Uh, 
Okay. Um, business analysis is, uh, well, I think uh, that is a, a specific idea to, to recreate or to provide uh, a product. And commercialization is uh, the fact when you have launched the product to the market. All right, very good, Carlita. All right, thank you, Carla. Vanessa, very nice. Let's see, what about the other, the last two? Test marketing and idea generation. Chambas Group, can you do that one for me? And be smart. I know you already did, right? Yes, miss. You yes, sure. Okay, let's, let's wait. Let's Chamba. Wait. Yes, uh, let's see, what about Tini and Vani? About the last two, test marketing and idea generation. For us, teacher, idea generation is make a meeting with a specific team and do a brainstorm to get uh, many ideas about the a specific topic or in this case about any product that you that they want all right very good and who else was with you all right trini yes there's marketing the example of the product so that people know about it okay all right very nice okay thank you guys okay so we have many different ideas and that's great. That's the whole idea and the purpose of it. You need to know how to express yourselves when you want to define something, all right? Sometimes defining is not very easy, okay? But you guys are doing a very, very well done, like a very great job, so that's fine. I'm gonna take the second attendance of the night, guys. So please pay attention. Just give me a second here. A ver, Abner Eli Fuentes Flores. Mm -hmm. Present. Thank you. Adela Trinidad Gonzalez Consuegra. Present. Claudia Guadalupe Arias de Gomez. Thank you, Claudita. Daniel Antonio Luna. Present teacher. Domingo Alexander Gonzalez. Present teacher. Ever de Jesús Candray Montano. Present teacher. Jorge Alfredo Argueta Flores. Present teacher. Very nice. Um, Jose Roberto Martinez Bernabe. Present teacher. Carla Benacir Lara Gonzalez. Present. Carla Michelle Brizuela Portillo. Present teacher. Carla Vanessa Vázquez de Ayala. Present. Thank you, Kevin. Esteban eh, Mejibar Merino. Leticia Guadalupe García de Miranda. Present teacher. Mariano José Paca Santa María. Oscar Arnulfo Villatoro Herrera. Present. Rafael Ernesto Hernández Sandoval. Present teacher. Salvador Augusto Sorto Rivas. Present miss. Thank you. Vanessa Noemí Reyes Lemus. All right, but it's there. Victoria Maria Vasquez Juarez. Walter Omar Castaneda Perlera. Mayra Roxana Hernandez Flores. Present. Thank you. Vicky Dinora Gutierrez de Durán. Bismar Ulises Martinez Ortiz. Present teacher. Doris Guadalupe Alfaro Rodriguez. Ana Maria Palacios Araujo. Present teacher. Thank you. All right, guys. Uh, solo recordarles, yo sé que hay unos que van todavía de camino y por eso tienen... I'm here, teacher. Sorry. Tienen la cámara apagada, otros sé que no están de camino, así es que por favor, si nos pueden encender la cámara. Yo sé que Abner, en caso de Abner, no tiene. All right, pero los demás sí tenemos que tener nuestra cámara encendida at all times. Thank you. All right, very good. Thank you, guys. Let's continue then here. Okay, so here we have, vamos a saltarnos esto un ratito y nos vamos a ir a la página 11. All right, page 11, number six, building vocabulary. This vocabulary is the same thing that we have here. 
All right, so now let's find out what the definitions are. All right, leamos entonces. Chamba, can you read this? Solo lo que yo le voy a subrayar, solo eso. You have to ask for the customer opinion. Thank you. All right, Vane, eh, Noemi, Vanesita, can you read number two in this? No? Okay. Sorry, teacher, I can't, I, I can't see the, the screen. <laughs> Sorry. Ah, okay, no se preocupe. Bismarck, can you continue with the next problem. one? That's okay, Vane. In this stage, research has to be conducted in order to be sure that the product will be accept as asset. accepted. 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 Once the product has been approved, it will be taken to be massively Reproduce, reproduced. Yeah, yeah, reproduced. Thank you. Ana Maria, can you do the next one? It presents. It presents the model products to be appreciated as a whole by the potential customer. Thank you. Daniel, continue. Is step warranties the filing idea be discarded immediately? Thank you. Rafael, continue. A careful design plan is important to make sure about the acceptance of the product. Thank you, Domingo, number seven. Brainstorming. Excellent, brainstorming, thank you. Trini, the last one. Once the idea has been completed, the product must be taken to a location where customer can get it. Excellent, thank you. All right, just give me a second, guys. Vamos a hacer esto antes de revisar or like match the definitions. Just give me a second. Oh, guys, come on. Hold on, I'm doing something wrong here. It's this. That's what I wanted to do, hold on. All right, guys, so here we have four, two, four, six. All right. Um, volume, ah, no, me falta una. Wait, guys. Design, design. All right, let's see. That's the one. Yep, am I missing another one? I don't think so. All right, very good. A ver, Chamba, usted es el primero, el primero que veo, Chamba. Regáleme all the pronunciation of the Seven highlighted words, please. Just the highlighted words, Shama. Con, conducted, mm -hmm. approved, mm -hmm. reproduced, appreciate, discard, designing, complete. Okay, very good. A ver, Walter, Omar. Conduct, approved. Reproduce, appreciate, discard, design, complete. All right, Ever, can you continue igual with the seven highlighted words, please? Let me say conduct, approve, reproduce, appreciate, discard, design it, and complete it. All right, very good. Oscar Arnulfo, can you go on with the seven highlighted words, please? Okay. Conduct, approve, reproduce, appreciated, discarded, design, and complete. Okay, very good. Let's see. What about Rafael? Rafael, can you go with the words? 
conduct, conducting a probing, a shading, is card, design, he completed. Okay, thank you. Let's see. Um, Abner, go ahead and then Carla Vanessa. Okay, conducted, approved, reproduced, repro reproduced, appreciate, discard, mm -hmm. designed, completed. Excellent, thank you. Oh, let's see, Carlita, Carla Vanessa, please. Okay, conducted, approved, reproduced, appreciated, discarded, disseminate, and complete. Designed. All right, okay, very good. Let's see. Anna, and then let's. Complete. Uh, conducted, approved, reproduced, reproduce, appreciate, discarded. Design complete. All right, thank you. Letty? Maybe Letty is not around. Approve it. Letty is in the court. Appreciate. Discard it, design it, complete it. Okay. All right. Carla Benazir, and then Jorgito, and then Daniel. Okay. Um, conducted, approved, reproduce, appreciate, discard it, design it, and complete. All right. Very good. Uh, let me just hold on, guys. No sé si alguien lo que estoy haciendo esto también lo quiere decir. Okay. All right, go ahead. Conduct, uh -huh. approve, reproduce, appreciate, discard, design, completed. Okay, very good. Alguien más que me falte? Danielito, uh -huh. right? Yes, teacher. Uh, conduct. Approve, reproduce, appreciate, discard, design, mm -hmm. complete. Okay, Domingo. Okay, teacher. Conduct, uh, approve, reproduce, appreciate, uh, discard, uh, design, complete. Okay, Vismar, did you tell me the words already? Um, conduct, approve, re, repro, reproduce, mm -hmm. appre, appreciate, discard, okay. design, and complete. All right, very good. Trini? Thank you. <laughs> Go ahead, Trini. Conduct, mm -hmm. approve, reproduce, appreciate, discard, design, Complete, complete. Okay, all right. Okay, I'm gonna stop sharing. Okay, guys, as you know, pronunciation is very important and it's basic, okay? So you need to know how to pronounce these. Some of them are verbs, some of them are adjectives. Al final del día, todos, en este caso, los siete que teníamos ahí, terminan con ed. All right, so you need to watch your pronunciation. All right, guys, it's very important that you do because that's how you manage to present yourselves. A ver, ya lo mandé al grupo. De hecho, también Abner ya lo mandó. Le salió mejor la foto que yo porque la tomé medio panda. All right, thank you, Abner. Very nice. The, the picture is there. Please pay attention. All right, I will tell you the words. Please pay attention. Conducted. Approved, reproduced, appreciated, discarded, designed, completed. All right, se las vuelvo a decir. Conducted, approved, reproduced, appreciated, discarded, 
designed, completed. All right? Yes? Mm -hmm. Could you be so kind to repeat the last one, please? Completed? Mm -hmm, exactly. Completed, yes. All right. Thank you, so much. Thank you very much. We're playing with three different pronunciations. Y eso lo venimos viendo con varios de ustedes desde el básico tres. All right. Tal vez no conmigo, pero sí sé que se ha visto esto del pasado o que termina con ed. Hay adjetivos que terminan con ed. All right. Ahora, la regla aplica igual. Ah, Ever, quiero ver. Usted tendrá por a la mano, Ever, el cuadro verde. Famoso cuadro verde. No lo tengo a la mano, teacher, pero se lo busco y se lo mando. Excelente. Mándelo al grupo de una vez y de ahí lo vamos a compartir. Ok. All right. All right. Entonces, solo para recordarles, hay tres. Cuando hablamos de los verbos o adjetivos que terminan con ed, hay tres diferentes pronunciaciones. A pesar de que todos escriben con ed, all right, unos van a sonar ed, otros van a sonar t y otros van a sonar t. All right. No todo en la vida es appreciated, work it, play it, dance it, confuse it. No. All right. You need to watch your pronunciation. Okay. So, cuando Ever esté listo, nos va a mandar un cuadrito que va a quedar en el grupo. Ese cuadro de verdad necesito que lo estudien. Okay. You guys are, in, are already intermediate too, okay? And then you keep on advancing. You need to keep on improving your pronunciation, okay? Right? A ver, Ever, were you able to find it? Lo logro encontrar, Ever. Yes. Yes, teacher. I shared it. All right. It's there, right? Okay, guys. Se lo voy a... No se los quiero poner ahorita aquí en la pantalla, pero ya está acá. All right. Ah, bueno. Se lo tiene ahí. <ríe> All right. Revísenlo. Vamos revisando. Quiero que lo abran. Todos están en el grupo de WhatsApp. Yes. Excellent. Ok. Niños, empezó a llover por acá. Just give me a second. The clothes. I'm sorry. What did you say, man? La ropa. <laughs> Se le va a mojar. Se acaba de acordar la ficha. All right, lo mío no era la ropa. <laughs> right. Ah, okay, okay, ya nos escuchó. Por <laughs> si está aquí estaba. <laughs> ay, ay. Okay, entonces, todos en el cuadrito verde, de acuerdo. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna say this just so you guys really understand what this is about. All right, tenemos tres pronunciaciones para los verbos o adjetivos que terminan con ed. La primera es ed, ed, no es id, es ed. La segunda es t. Haga solo, no es t, ¿verdad? Es este de tomate, es el sonido t y no vibra acá, acá no vibra nada, hágale tss, y póngase la manito aquí, no vibra tss, tss, tss. no hay vibración y la otra es tss, tss. ahí sí hay vibración es una, el sonido de la D alright, entonces si usted está viendo su cuadrito verde ¿cuándo vamos a pronunciar ed Solo cuando el verbo termine con la letra T o la letra D. Cuando, me, cuando yo digo cuando el verbo termine, es el verbo en su forma base. Porque todos estos van a terminar con ED. All right? En escritura. Pero cuando yo digo forma base, retomo, por ejemplo, el verbo want termina con T en su forma base. Cuando lo paso al pasado, digo wanted y digo needed. Entonces, esas son las únicas dos veces que usted puede pronunciar los verbos así. Wanted, needed. 
Fíjense que ahí no está la K, por ejemplo. Usted no puede decir work it. That's not possible, guys. ¿Ok? Sigan la siguiente columna y dice, si su verbo en forma base termina con la P, la K, SH, CH, GH, TH, S, C y X, su pronunciación es T. Por ejemplo, helped. No digo helped. No digo looked. Digo looked. Digo washed. Digo laughed. Breathed. Kissed, danced, and fixed. All right. Hay una t al final. Y si su verbo en forma base termina con la L, la N, la R, la G, la B, la S, la W, Y y Z, su verbo va a terminar con D. Called, cleaned, offered, damaged, loved, Used, followed. Yes. All right. Ahora, es importante que usted se aprenda este cuadro verde. Ok. Pregunta sobre el cuadro y pregunta sobre la pronunciación. ¿Cómo dijo que tenía que sonar la T en mi garganta? No, no, no vibra, Domingo. Si usted dice T. No hay vibración. Ah, y en la D, sí hay vibración. Ah, sí, oiga. Oh, póngase la manito usted ¿sí aquí. D, D, D. D, D. Exacto, vibra. Ah. All right. D, Obviamente okay. usted no va a andar por el mundo con la mano en la garganta. All right. Yes, eso no es posible. Eh, pero usted ya tiene que aprenderse, por eso es importante aprenderse la, la terminación. All right. Yes. Voy a vol vamos a volver a ver el cuadrito, en la foto que tom tomó Abner en el grupo antes del cuadro verde. Tenemos la primera. ¿Cómo pronunciamos la primera entonces? ¿Alguien? Es conducted. Conducted. Ed. ¿Por qué? Porque termina en B. Conducted. A ver, la segunda termina en B. ¿Cómo va a ser la pronunciación? Approved. Approved. Very good. Approved. Muy bien. Gracias, Abner. Pero necesito que los demás también participen. A ver, la tercera termina en C. ¿Cómo va a ser la pronunciación? Reproduce. Reproduce. No. Reproduce. No sé. Usted dígame. No, es reproduced. Reproduce. Es reproduce. Re reproduced. Reproduced. All right. Y ahí Reproduced. Otra. La otra es, ya no veo. Uh, appreciate. Pero te termina. ¿Cuál sería la pronunciación final? Appreciate. Appreciated. Appreciated. Muy bien. Appreciated. Muy bien. What about la otra? ¿Dónde está Discord? Termina en D y la pronunciación sería? Discarded. 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 Muy bien. Discarded. A ver, la otra es design. Termina en N. Designed. Designed. Que vibre, que vibre. Y la última dice, what's the last one? Complete. Y esa suena como? Completed. 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 Yes. Okay. All right. Excuse, excuse me. Designed. 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 All right. A ver. ¿Alguien quiere intentar otra vez para ver si hoy mejoramos un poquito ahorita? Si no, sí. si usted no me levanta la mano, yo lo yo hago que usted levante la mano. Me dicho. Excelente, Vane. Conducted, mm -hmm. approved, no. reproduced. Vanesita, no. approved, con D al final. Approved. Reproduced, appreciated, excellent, 
discarded, excellent, designed, muy bien, completed, excellent, very nice, a very good one. Another volunteer. Si no, yo hago que se haga voluntario. Ajá, uh -huh. no, volunteer one, volunteer two, volunteer three, okay. no. All right. Sí. Conducted, 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 ajá. Uh -huh. Conducted, eh, as, ¿qué me puedo? Accepted, accepted, approved, 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 uh -huh. y reproduced. Reproduct. Reproduced. Reproduce. 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 Eh, ap y al final, Domingo. Uh -huh. Appreci appreciate. Appreciated. Appreciated. Uh -huh. eh, discarded. Yes. Designed. No. Designed. Designed. Muy bien. Uh -huh. Designed. Yes. Computed. Computed. Very nice. Okay. Chamba. Ajá, chamba. Thank you, Domingo. Conducted. Hmm? Proved. We produce it. No. Appreciate. No. Produced. ¿Cómo sería ese? We produced. Excellent. Hoy sí. Mucho mejor. Ajá. Appreciated. Excellent. Discard. Discarded. Discarded. Designed. No, designed, no. Designed. Muy bien, Salvador. Very nice, Chamba. Yes, the last one. And com completed. Excellent, Chamba. Very nice. Yes. All right. Very well done. Thank you. A ver, any other volunteer? Volunteer, volunteer? No? All right, what about Carla Vanessa? Carla Vanessa, you tell me, and then Oscar Arnulfo. Okay. Conductor. Mm -hmm. Approved. Yes. Reproduced. Very nice. Appreciate. Appreciated. Appreciated. Excellent. Discard. Excellent. Designer. No. Design. Very good, Carla Vanessa. Very nice. And completed. Excellent. Very nice. Oscar. Hello. <laughs> Conducted. Excellent. Approved. Reproduce. Very good. Appreciated. Is color, design, incomplete. Excellent, Oscar. Very nice. Very well done. Thank you. All right. So, guys, ya tienen el cuadrito verde. All right, no lo pierda. Okay, cada vez que nos encontremos con este tipo de verbos o adjetivos que terminen con ED, me voy a detener y vamos a hacer la pronunciación. De acuerdo. Yes. Okay, very nice. So, let's continue then here. Okay. What are we gonna do now? You guys are going to, can you see my screen? Yes. Yes, yes teacher. Right, thank you. Yes, okay. teacher. Thank you. So what I want you to do right now is this. I want you to match the name of the steps in the process of developing, oh, sorry, on, of developing a new product to their corresponding definition. Here we have the steps, here you have the definition. So for example, if for you business analysis is brainstorming, okay. Or if for you business analysis is you have to ask for the customer's opinion, okay. All right, you decide. That's activity number one, okay. And activity number two, I want you to go back to this, all right? It says building vocabulary. Go online, or see you say, or pueden ir a Google if you want to, to find out more about these key terms. What is prototype? What is target audience? What is manufacturing? And what is positioning, all right? 
Bueno, no tienen que pensar ustedes. You can Google it. Ahora, si usted sabe, entonces you write it. If you need help, you can go online and check for it. Okay? So please work on this first. And then we you work on this other exercise after. Okay? Questions or everything is clear? Everything's okay? It's concept. It's concept. Excuse me, Domingo? It's concept. The, the... Sí, es, sí, solo pueden auxiliarse de... Eh... Mr. Google. Right, yes. All right. Yes, Daniel, your question. No, no questions? Okay. Let's go back, guys. Igual, niños, solo recordarles, las cámaras las necesito encendidas. All right, thank you. Let's go to your groups. Ever, ¿con quién estaba? ¿En qué grupo estaba, Ever? Déjeme acordarme. Ah, estaba con Rafael y después Oscar. entró Oscar. Ahorita lo mando. Vaya. A ver, Leti, ¿en qué grupo estaba Leti? Mm, aún no tuve grupo, teacher, es que tenía problemas con el internet. Ahorita uh -huh. lo mando. All right. Eh, Claudita, ¿puede participar o todavía no? Yes, teacher, sí. Excelente, very nice, Claudita. La voy a mandar a las 7 y a Vicky igual la mando a las 7. Vicky, ¿puede participar? Dime no. Vane, Vane, ¿en qué grupo estaba? ¿Se recuerda? Six. Con Trini. Ah. Pero sabe que la voy a cambiar porque yo creo que Vicky no puede participar ahorita. Así Claudita no se me queda sola. Ok. Thank you.
Hola, Leti. Leti. Hi, teacher. Hi teacher. Okay. Um, pero era grupo 6, recuerdo que era el grupo 6.
All right, guys, let's continue with this, please. We're going to do this right now. Um, Carla, Vanessa, I'm not sure if you have, do you happen to have number one for that one? What is business analysis? What would be the definition? I'm going to try to, to talk because it's raining here. Oh, okay. Don't worry about it. Yeah, it's raining everywhere, I think. Just give me a second. I just something here. Hold on, give me a second. All right, let's see here. I just want to check something out. All right, so everybody's back, right? I'm not seeing everyone right now. All right, so what about, uh, Rafael, can you tell me what would be number one for exercise six? The concept development and testing. Yeah, what is business analysis? What is it for you? I consider in the business analysis and um, is this situation research had to be conducted in order to be sure that the product will be accepted. Okay, Rafael, what is number two? Yes, what do you have for that one? Is uh, in my in my point in opinion, is this stage of research has to be conducted in order to be sure that the product will be accepted. Oh, the, the second one in this stage, SIS. Yes. All right. Everybody agrees with Rafael or you guys have something different? I have something different teacher. And this step guarantees that filing ideas be discarded immediately. This step guarantees the fading ideas will be be discarded mm -hmm. immediately. All right. Anybody else with business analysis? Uh, yes. Anybody else has it has something? Me teacher. Me teacher. All right. Okay. Tell mm. me. In this stage, research has to be conducted in order to be sure that the product will accept. Ah, all right. Okay. That's another idea. Let me just see here. It's the same one, the same one that Rafael said. Teacher. Okay, tell me. Teacher. Hola. It okay. Uh, business analysis. It's present the model product to be appreciated, appreciated as a whole by the potential customer. Oh, that's what you have. Oh my goodness, guys. So we have quite a different answers here. All right. So this is what we're going to do because of time. I'm not going to give you the answers today. We're going to talk about the answers tomorrow because I want to present something like to you that we are going to talk about tomorrow. All right. But I want to show you this. And this is something that we are going to work on tomorrow, the whole class. All right. So here, y esa es parte ya de su tarea dos, me parece. All right. So vamos a darle el intro del tema. And we have here present perfect, okay? So this is the grammar that we need to take a look at in this um, unit, present perfect. Now, what is present perfect? Present perfect is a tense, all right? 
And it talks about an action that started in the past, but the action may continue. All right? Si usted solo se concentra en el pasado, se dice, I went to, I went to Guatemala. All right? Finished. All right? But the present perfect, the action is started, and it goes all the way until the moment of speaking. For example, I can say, I have gone to Guatemala many times. Ya he ido, ya fui, y pueda que vuelva a ir. Entonces, la acción continúa de alguna forma. All right, so that is the present perfect. Igual, mañana lo vamos a ver mejor esto eh, despacio. Ahora, how do we make present perfect, guys? We are going to use the auxiliary have and the auxiliary has. Plus the verbs, ¿ok? Ahora, ¿qué tipo de verbo? El, el pasado participio del verbo, ¿all right? Entonces, para los verbos regulares no es difícil porque todos son ed, los pasados participios, pero para los irregulares el pasado participio cambia, ¿all right? So we need to know that, ¿ok? I'm just gonna just double check here. Vamos a ver. Um, Bismar, the past participle of go, Bismar. What is the past participle of go? Went. That's it, that's simple past. Gone. Gone, very good, all right. So go, went, gone. All right, let's see. Chamba, what is the past participle of eat? Eight. The simple past. Eaten. 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 Very nice. Yes, very good. Ever de Jesus, Candra y Montano, what is the past participle of speak? Hasta lo asusté, Ever. Uh huh, the past participle of speak. Spoken. Excellent. Busco la lista, Ever. I got it. Excellent. No, no. <laughs> Very no, nice. me lo puedo. Excellent. El único que me puedo. Ay, Dios mío, a pues le pegué. Very good. Carla Vanessa, a ver, the past participle of do. Uh, done. Done. Very nice. All right. Uh, let's see, Anna, the past participle of sleep. Sleep. Very nice, thank you. All right, Carlita, the past participle of lose. Carlita? Repeat, chef. Yes, the past participle of lose. Lose. Yeah, de perder. De extraviar. Lost. Lost. Yes, lost. All right. Very nice. Ok. Entonces, para poder ocupar el presente perfecto, necesitamos estudiar y saber y conocer y aprendernos todos los verbos en pasado participio. De lo contrario, no lo vamos a poder usar. All right. Para hacer las oraciones afirmativas, usted necesita, obviamente, el subject plus the auxiliary have or has, dependiendo. Si yo digo Rafael, digo Rafael has gone, o Rafael has studied, o Rafael has played. All right. Ahora, si yo digo Domingo and Daniel have uh, been in uh, a watch Japan for many weeks. All right. Okay. So, vamos a jugar con los auxiliares have y el auxiliar has más los pasados participios de los verbos. All right. Así es que eh, yo sé que algunos tienen su lista de verbo por ahí. Sáquenla, desempolvenla y mañana la usamos. All right. Voy a tomar la última asistencia. Trini, hoy se queda un ratito conmigo, Trini. Hoy no fue la primera, hoy fue la segunda. Abner Eli Fuentes Flores. Present, I'm here. Thank you. Adela Trinidad González Consuelo. Present. Claudia Guadalupe Arias de Gómez. Present, teacher. 
Nice to see you. Daniel Antonio Luna. Present teacher. Eh, Domingo Alexander González. Present teacher. Ever de Jesús Candray Montano. Present teacher. Jorge Alfredo Argueta Flores. Present teacher. José Roberto Martínez Bernabé. Eh, Carla Benacir Lara González. Present. Carla Michelle Brizuela Portillo. Present teacher. Vanessa Vázquez de Ayala. Present. Kevin Esteban Mejíbar Merino. Leticia Guadalupe García de Miranda. Present teacher. Mariano José Paca Santa María. Oscar Arnulfo Villatoro Herrera. Present. Rafael Ernesto Hernández Sandoval. Present teacher. Salvador Augusto Sorto Rivas. Present Miss. Thank you. Vanessa Noemí Reyes Lemus. Vanesita, ahí está, ya la vi, Vanesita. Victoria María. <risa> Walter Omar Casaneda Perlera. Mayra Roxana Hernández Flores. Present teacher. Thank you. Vicky Dinora Gutiérrez de Durán. Present teacher. Ismar Ulises Martínez Ortiz. Present teacher. Doris Guadalupe Alfaro Rodríguez. Ana María Palacios Araujo. Present teacher. Thank you. All right, guys. Thank you so much for being with me tonight. I will see you all tomorrow. Tomorrow se me queda Claudita un ratito. All right. Eh, hoy se queda Trini. All right, guys. Bye. Have a good night. Carla Michelle. Bye. Bye. Good night. Bye. Good night. Bye. Good night. Good night. Good night. Hola, teacher. Eh, usted va, va a reportarlo o yo tengo que reportarlo. Eh, si gusta, hagámoslo. Eh, las dos, yo lo reporto también y también usted ¿verdad? Pero no, yo, decir, a yo voy a escribir al, al último chat que me escribieron para, para ver confirmar, e incluso confirmé con mi anterior compañera y dice que sí, ella está en el básico dos no sé qué, qué pasó aquí vaya Carlita, no se preocupe igual, eh, yo voy a escribir mañana, pero también haga lo usted oye Bye, esté bien. Muchas gracias, oiga. Mucho gusto. Feliz noche. Bye. All right. Ajá, uh -huh. señorita Trini, how are you? I'm fine. And you? I'm great, Trini. I'm good. It's raining here. It's not raining over there? No. Oh. All right. Not raining. ¿Cómo le va en el cole? Ay, ay. <risa> ¿Y ya regresaron presencial, Trini? La mayoría, solo tres se van en casa y están sacando todo lo que tienen guardado. Sí. <risa> Algunos. ¿Y tiene bastantes niños y niñas, Trini? Pues no mucho, fíjate. 21 tengo, pero. Pero imagínense, solo llegan. 18. Sí. Y hay tres que han hecho un grupito ahí que está medio, medio complicado. Me imagino. All right. Pero bueno, ahí vamos. Sí, qué bueno. Qué bueno, Tini. Very nice. Tini, no sé si tiene alguna pregunta. Igual mañana nos vamos a detener más con el presente perfecto, ¿verdad? Pero I don't know if you have any questions. Sí. Eh, quería ver si me, me reforzaba un poquito el último tema que vimos, creo que era el del ciclo pasado, del, del ¿cómo se llama? ¿Futuro? ¿Del futuro? Ajá, uh -huh. I will go, I am going. ¿Era el uso del will, Trini, se acuerda? Sí, sí, el uso del will. Ok, eh, lo que pasa Trini es que hay tres formas, bueno, hay varias, pero hay tres formas principales para referirnos al futuro. Una de ellas obviamente es el will, el otro es el be going to y el otro es el presente, eh, el presente continuo o el presente progresivo. Cuando usamos el will, solo, digamos que ese es el más fácil porque a toda la gente se le va a poner will y luego el verbo y a eso es futuro. ¿verdad? Usted dice, I will go, she will take, uh, they will sleep, we will study. All right. Media vez le puso el will, ya el verbo se vuelve en futuro. 
All right, ahora, este futuro, eh, Trini, es algo no certero, ¿verdad? Nos queda como la duda de que sí o que sí no. Entonces, si lo quiere ver en una escala, es como el 50%. All right, entonces, esa es como la gran diferencia con el uso del will, que el futuro no es muy certero, eh, que es cuando usted... Mm, predice cosas, pero no tiene como una evidencia, no se basa en nada. Solo es como, por decirle alguna corazonada, o sea, se va a llover, pero ni está tronando, ni está pringando, no está gris el cielo, usted simplemente dice, it will rain. Luego tenemos el be going to, que usamos el verbo to be, más el going to, más el verbo, ¿verdad? Por ejemplo, yo digo, I am going to, eh, Watch TV tonight. Ok. Ahora, ese be going to, ese sí es certero. Digamos que del 100%, casi que un 98% de probabilidad que sí suceda. Ok. Obviamente, como decimos, be going to, usted lo va a conjugar el verbo be que corresponde, ¿verdad? Si usted tiene he, she, it, lo, corre, lo conjuga con is. Tiene a you we day, lo conjuga con are, y si solo tiene I, pues es am. ¿Verdad? Going to, y luego el verbo en su forma base. Entonces, ese es eh, certero, es haciendo una predicción basada en evidencia, ¿verdad? Y es algo que ya usted tiene planeado hacer. ¿Ok? Mientras que el futuro usando presente continuo lo ocupamos para sí futuro, pero para, um, ¿cómo le explico? Para situaciones o acciones que están agendadas. All right? No solo está planificado, sino que tengo como una agenda. Ya está, por, por decirle algo. Si usted entrega planificaciones todos los lunes a su coordinadora o coordinador, usted dice, I am presenting my lesson plans on Monday. Y si se lo piden a las 7 de la mañana, on Monday at 7 in the morning. ¿Por qué ocupamos el presente continuo? Porque la acción está en futuro y aparte de eso ya está calendarizada, está agendada. ¿Ok? 100% seguro. Sí. Ajá, y aparte tiene como fecha. Ahora, si usted se enferma es otra cosa, ¿verdad? Pero la planificación estaba para ser entregada tal día. All right. Entonces, digamos que ese es, y ese es el presente continuo puro que conocemos, ¿verdad? Usted tiene el, el sujeto, verbo y el ING. He is presenting, she is going, they are speaking, etc. All right. Okay. Lo, de, lo de lo que estamos haciendo de pasar la, los números, eso lo vamos a ver mañana. Sí, sí, sí. Sí, eso lo vamos a terminar mañana. Uh -huh. okay. Excelente, Trini. Un gusto nuevamente tenerla en clase. All right. Thank you. Descanse, Trini. Bye. Gracias, igualmente. Voy a estar mañana. Yes. Bye.